Now, this pandemic has, of course, been such a roller coaster for restaurants, many of which still struggling to just stay afloat. And while today's request from the governor to pause indoor dining isn't a hard rule, it's not what restaurant owners want to hear. Priya Mann live now with reaction from some of those people whose livelihoods are at stake here. Priya? You know, Sandra, Devin, I've talked to a lot of restaurant owners since the pandemic began. They are all extremely concerned about the safety of their staff and guests. <laughs> But reaction was mixed today about Governor Whitmer's recommendation. And I'm strongly encouraging all Michiganders to avoid dining indoors. Support your local restaurants by eating outside or getting carry out instead of dining indoors. The governor offering recommendations instead of imposing restrictions for the next two weeks. I felt like I just got stabbed in the heart again. Robert Milner owns Square One Eats and Treats in Waterford. He wasn't at his restaurant today because he was forced to go back to his previous career as a sales manager at a car dealership. He disagrees with the governor's recommendation. It's kind of a double edged sword for me because my livelihood is being affected by people being afraid of eating in dining rooms. Some owners like Q Broden pivoted early on. Even as the state reopened, the new center restaurant has only offered carry out, meal prep and 12 person private events. She supports the governor's plan. So I think what she said makes perfect sense. I'm not mad. I'm very big on protecting people. Safety is a priority for both Q and Robert. The restaurant owners just disagree on the best path forward as COVID cases continue to surge. I don't have an outdoor uh, dining facility. Um, I don't have uh, a, a menu that is necessarily conducive to carry out. We don't allow people to dine in and sometimes it makes people upset, but the reality is it's for the protection of you and my staff. Now, the Michigan Restaurant and Lodging Association does not agree with the governor. In a statement, they say, while we support and echo the governor's call for a surge of vaccines to be prioritized for Michigan, we believe her suggested recommendation around indoor dining is misguided and doesn't track with available data. The continued scapegoating of the restaurant industry without proof or reliable data won't make herd immunity come any sooner. And again, the governor asking all Michiganders to avoid indoor dining for the next two weeks. Reporting live from News Center, I'm Priya Mann. Local 4. All right. Thank you, Priya.